amazing animal friends. Our Amazing Animal Friends by Jean S. Stewart. A blue whale, largest animal on earth, splashes in the sea. This is a caption. This is important to read about a nonfiction book. It gives you information about the pictures that you're looking at. Mammals. Meet some champions of the animal world. Many live on the land. Many swim in the sea. Some fly the farthest. Some fly, run the fastest. A few are amazingly tall or amazingly small. The largest land mammal. An African elephant is so big that even its baby can be as heavy as a very big man. Look for the drawings that show you how big animals are next to a six-year-old child. The last page gives the sizes. little baby. This is my favorite animal. Largest seal. With a loud roar, a male elephant seal warns other males to stay away. Adult males weigh more than three small pickup trucks or 177 first graders. Oh my goodness, our class has 24 first graders and this seal weighs more than 177. Oh my goodness. Look at that seal. The largest primate. Gorillas are the largest of all the monkeys and apes, but they are shy, gentle giants. Standing up straight, an adult male gorilla would be as tall as a grown man. Largest deer. Moose are members of the deer family. Sometimes the males use their antlers to push each other. They are finding out which of them is stronger. See in the picture, two moose fight with their antlers. But that's kind of funny, there's like a referee. That's just pretend. Largest jackrabbit. Alert for danger. An antelope jackrabbit sits very still. It is not a rabbit at all. It is a hare. This is the largest and the fastest kind of jackrabbit in North America. Largest cat. A Siberian tiger has grown a thick winter coat that keeps it warm. Tigers are the largest of all cats and Siberians are the biggest tigers. Largest wild dog. Bending low, a gray wolf stretches in a snowy wood. It looks like a German shepherd dog. Wolves hunt in groups for large animals, such as a moose. Largest rodent. A capybara cools off by wading. Webbed toes help it swim and dive. Capybaras look somewhat like guinea pigs. This word right here, wading, it just kind of means like hanging out in the shallow waters of a pool or a lake or a river. Ooh, I love giraffes. The tallest mammal. Giraffes are the tallest land animals. You'd be tall too if your neck were as long as your legs. A giraffe's neck has only seven bones, the same as yours. Its neck bones are just longer. Smallest bear. Expert climbers, Malayan sun bears, live in forests. They build nests and trees for napping. Adult sun bears might be about as tall as you are. So cute. Smallest deer. A padu is small enough to hide in high grass. This tiny deer belongs to the same family as the moose, but it weighs less than a moose's newborn calf. Smallest primate. What's this? It may look like a giant to a little cricket, 
But this mouse lemur is so small you could hold it in the palm of your hand. These tiny cousins of gorillas eat insects, spiders, small frogs, fruits, and plants. So this is these tiny cousins of gorillas, so it means they have relations to the gorilla family. Look at its feet. Fastest mammal, a cheetah watches. Maybe it is looking for prey. Cheetahs are smaller than tigers, but they are the speediest of all land animals. Cheetahs have slim bodies and long legs. This shape helps them race after prey. Slowly, silently, a cheetah follows its prey, then suddenly takes off and attacks. For short distances, it can go faster than a car, traveling 55 miles an hour. After a hunt and a big meal, a cheetah likes to rest a while. Females with young must hunt often to feed their families. Look at this cheetah. When it's running, no leg is on the ground. So now we're in fish. Earlier we were all in mammals, but now we're going to learn about a fish. Largest fish. What polka dot giants looks like a whale but is really a fish? A whale shark, the biggest fish in the sea. Harmless to people, the sharks eat small sea animals. That's a person right there, scuba diving. Look how big this fish is. Reptiles, largest lizard. Is this a fire breathing dragon? No, it's a monitor lizard also called a Komodo dragon. It is more than twice as long as a six-year-old child lying down. The lizard uses its forked tongue to gather smells from the air. Largest tortoise. Aldebra tortoises live on islands in the Indian Ocean. A tortoise is a turtle that lives on land. The slow-moving tortoise is famous for living a long time. Some live for more than 100 years. Largest reptile. A saltwater crocodile is twice as long as the Komodo dragon. It eats fish, reptiles, birds, and other animals. These reptiles can live on land or in water. The crocodiles can swim in the ocean. They even travel from island to island. Amphibians. Largest toad. The striped burrowing frog sitting on this marine's toad, marine toad's head would fit in your hand. A marine toad is a dangerous if an enemy bites. Is dangerous if an enemy bites. I'm going to read that again. A marine toad is dangerous if an enemy bites it. Its skin has poison in it. Frogs and toads are amphibians. They spend part of their lives in water and part on land. So we have mammals, fish, reptiles, amphibians. These are types of animals. Crustaceans. Largest crustacean. This long-legged relative of lobsters and shrimps is a spider crab. It lives in very deep water. Spider crabs take 10 years to reach adult size. Mollusks, largest clam. Very carefully, a diver looks at a giant clam. If anything passes over it, the clam closes up. This kind of mollusk has two shells. The animal is inside. So crustaceans, mollusks, insects, largest wingspan. Long wings make the South American owlet moth an amazing insect. These moths come out at night to feed on flowers. They belong to one of the largest insect families. Butterflies are their cousins. Longest butterfly migration. So migration is when they travel far to move to a new area. Millions of monarch butterflies travel a long way. 
flying across the United States from Canada to Mexico in the autumn. They rest in winter and fly north in spring. These little champs live only one year. Look how beautiful those butterflies are. So we had mammals, fish, reptiles, insects, crustaceans, mollusks. These are all types of animals. Birds. Largest bird. Ostriches are birds that do not fly, but they can run as fast as a racehorse and can keep up the speed for half an hour. That's 30 minutes. Wow. They are too tall to enter most doorways. An ostrich t tends its chicks and eggs, the biggest and strongest eggs of any bird living today. One weighs about three and a half pounds. Longest bird migration. Arctic terns migrate farther than any other bird. Twice each year, they fly about halfway around the world. In summer, they nest and raise their young in the Arctic. They fly to the coast of Antarctica for the winter. Largest wingspan. So the wingspan is how big their wings are when they're all the way open. A male wandering albatross tries to win a mate by showing off his wings. Long wings help the birds glide easily on ocean winds. This is a picture of comparison. They're comparing the bird's wingspan to this boy. Two giraffes watch for danger. A giraffe is so tall it can pluck leaves from some treetops with a tongue up to 21 inches long. Oh my goodness. And this is from the cover page. African elephants use their trunks to sniff the wind, to gather food, and to drink. In hot weather, the animals cool off by using their large ears as fans. The end. So this book about our amazing animal friends helps us learn about all types of animals. So if we go back again, types of animals, we had mammals. We had fish reptiles, amphibians, that pH makes a sound, amphibians, amphibians, crustaceans, mollusks, insects, and birds. There's all types of animals, so I'm so excited for us to keep learning about our amazing animal friends. Bye, everybody.